my name's David Moore. Um, I work for the um, Creative Industries Department as a graphic design teacher. Um, my other hats is I actually run my own design freelance business. Um, I ran a design company for 13 years, uh, which I shut down in 2003 to come to lovely Melbourne to go to VCA to study film and television for, well, I'm still there, I'm still um, finishing, done a diploma, uh, I've done a master's and now I'm doing a master's research in screenwriting. I made a couple of shorts at VCA. Um, I think coming the whole plan of going to VCA worked terrifically because they really take you to a new creative height. And I made some shorts that um, one of them in particular went into 15 international festivals and got me a, a, a taxpayer's plane ticket to uh, San Francisco for the international festival there in, in 05, which was an amazing experience. I'm John Langer and uh... I'm connected with the radio component of our course and uh, have been for many years. We started uh, radio production, oh, many, many years ago. We built it uh, over quite a long time. The current initiative, I guess you could say, if you want to think about it as creative arts, is uh, Radio VU, which is a web streaming radio station. Radio VU Online. my city of Pristina. I was aged 12. My name's Natasha Dwyer. I'm a lecturer in multimedia and I've worked for the university since 2000. Since that time I've also held a part-time permanent contract at the Australian Centre for the Moving Image, a public cultural institution as an interactive designer. In 1989 and my parents migrated here from the Philippines in 1983. Hi, my name's Brooke. I was born in Australia in 1990 and both of my parents were born and raised here as well. Como esta? My name is Ayan Winter and I was born in 1989. I'm currently undertaking a PhD supported by British Telecom and that's looking at trust and interactive design. And that's about how people perceive trust messages and how those who are from different sorts of groups can, become, can present messages in a way that are trusted. My name is Enza Gandolfo and I work in um, the School of Commun Communication and the Arts and I teach in creative writing mainly. I teach um, fiction writing in the undergrad area and a lot of my workload here is supervision. I've got um, a couple of creative writing projects that I'm currently working on. One of them I'm, at the moment I've called Feminist Flaneur. Uh, which is based on the Flaneur idea, the Baudelaire um, in, in Paris, which was very much the idea of the male poet walking the streets and walking with the crowd and observing the crowd. Last year I worked with Sue Dodd, who's a visual and performance artist, also lecturing here in the school, and we worked on a project called Inventory on Op Shops. I'm Sue Dodd and I am a creative um, practitioner. I'm an artist. I work across disciplines. I, I'm trained as a visual artist and I teach painting and drawing here so I teach the fundamentals. Is it true Jude Law likes to pole dance? The Queen nearly killed two of her corgis. Madonna's got B.O. Yes, 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 yes. My own work is, involves um, uh, video art and also um, performance. I've actually used some of the resources here at VU while I've been working here to make my own videos. Lesson one, 
Find yourself a celebrity arm to decorate. Lesson two. Have a nervous breakdown. Currently, as I speak, got an Lesson exhibition three. on in Korea. My name is Paul Borg. I teach. Um, I'm a painter and artist, and I teach at um, Victoria University in the um, Creative Department, the Visual Arts. And I've been teaching there for um, 24 years now, in quite a while. And um, from the Western Suburbs, I grew up in the Western Suburbs and um, lived here all my life. And um, my artwork or my paintings deal with the Western Suburbs. I've sort of watched it change, watched the people change, the landscape change and the thinking change also. So I've been sort of um, obsessed, I suppose, and put it for years just documenting the, um, the Western Suburbs. Hi, my name is Robert DeYoung and I teach in radio and television production and also in a subject called writing and producing the documentary. Uh, I'm lucky that my teaching directly relates to my areas of industrial expertise. I used to work for ABC Radio and ABC Television for a long time. These days I do as much freelance work as I can. I wish a falling star could fall forever and spark. I produced uh, a television documentary on Errol Flynn for the ABC last year and I'm currently working on one for SBS Television. And as you can see behind me here too, I'm currently struggling with a piece of software called WaveLab because I also do a lot of writing and production for ABC Radio National. Hi, I'm Megan Chudley and I teach in the multimedia and creative arts areas. Most of my energy in my work in the last um, four to five years particularly has been spent looking at the integration of work integrated learning and community projects within the multimedia and creative arts programs. It's led to a, a lot of really interesting stuff. Um, including our students doing things like working on uh, mobile interactive games for Melbourne Zoo, production of DVD and multi-language um, formats for African refugee community. I guess a lot of my research interest now is springing out of the learning in the workplace and community activities that the multimedia students are doing. My name's Luke Lau, lecturer of Innovative Pedagogies at uh, Victoria University. Uh, in my last four years at the university, uh, my role basically has combined uh, my three passions, um, education, creativity and technology. I've come to the university with a commercial background developing websites for a broad range of local and international clientele. Um, outside the university, I'm a photographer, painter, videographer and to a large extent a um, freelancer. My name's John Welton, um, I'm a writer, I've worked in music, I've written scripts um, that have been produced by the Melbourne Museum, planetarium shows, um, TV and film scripts, I've contributed to comedy. I'm currently doing a PhD in a novel, In uh, the PhD is in creative writing. The novel is a, a rite of passage, love story, uh, man grows up or doesn't grow up. And uh, I hope to get that published in the next uh, couple of years once the PhD is, is completed and um, write the next one. I'm Megan Campbell and um, I'm a, a sculptor. I trained at the Victorian College of the Arts in the late 80s. The work that I tend to do reflects on pattern and ornament in um, contemporary art. So. The work that I've been using, or well, materials that I've been using in my work have included things like fly wire, safety pins, um, actual little stainless steel pins, and um, materials found from the home. <laughs> 